So the aim of the virtual reality tour is that we allow students to be immersed into the virtual classroom and they get to interact with certain elements within the classroom. For example, the Five Owner has the Dow Lab where they have experiments. The kids can do the experiments without having to physically be here and still understand what they're working with and what um, components go together with each of the experiments. Electricity powers our homes, our businesses, and our communities. We can't see it, but we know it's there. To understand electricity, let's take a closer look at how it's made. About 200 years ago, a man named Michael Faraday discovered how to make an electric current using a metal coil and a magnet. Most of today's electricity is still made exactly this way. But to generate enough electricity for a province the size of Ontario, we need to move big magnets around a wire. This is done with a turbine. The force to turn this turbine could come from wind, water, hot gases, or steam. You can spin a turbine with a natural force, like hydro, that's water, or wind. You can burn natural gas directly in a combustion turbine. The hot expanding gases are used to make it turn. This is ultimately about edutech. I mean, from mining, um, from um, train, how the train operates, from fossils, from any other experience that you, that you can find. There's also, I mean, what we've discovered inside, there's also some um, experiments around um, injuries that you might um, encounter on a sports field. There's a number of things, number of interesting things, and it will really be beneficial to all the students. Those that can afford and those that can afford, but ultimately is to broaden access to education using EduTech.